Welcome back to Studio 701. The, the month of May brings color and sunshine all around, and it's no wonder moms everywhere get the spotlight this month. <laughs> now joining us is Carolyn Moore, a mom herself and the editor-in-chief of the website Her View From Home. Thank you so much for being here Thanks today, for Carolyn. Thanks having me, yeah. Okay, so we're <laughs> excited about this new book. I mean, this is a great <laughs> idea for anyone looking shopping for mom right now ahead of Mother's Day. Absolutely. So God Made a Mother. Yes. Tell us about this book. Yes, so this is a book that has been about three years in the making. So I work for the website called Her View From Home, like you mentioned, and we took some, uh, we have contributors involved. So it's kind of a little bit like chicken soup for the soul, if you think of it that way. We have about 90 contributors, uh, and we got about 500 submissions for the book. So we kind of went through those and chose, uh, chose just various topics of motherhood. It kind of covers everything, all ages, all stages, all backgrounds. We've got young moms, we've got moms with kids who are grown. We have some who maybe want to be a mom. We sort of joke that it's, if you are a mother or you had a mother or you know a mother, that it's for you. So there's something probably inside for, for anybody if you pick it up and kind of can, can see yourself on the pages is what we're hoping, so yeah. What do you hope readers do get by picking up this book? It's for everyone, Yeah. but yeah, what do you hope yeah. it, it does for them. Yeah, one of the things that we've been hearing actually from, it's been out for two weeks now, um, is just the, the way that it's kind of brought people together. A lot of it, something we talk about a lot is just sharing your story. Like, Amber, you've got three kids, mm -hmm. you have a story that's worth telling. Uh, and even if you don't write it down and sit down and, and record it like that, maybe you sit down with another mom and you pick up this book and say, oh, did you read this about infertility or something? Like, I really identify with that. Maybe I went through that. Maybe I know someone who's gone through that. So I think the connection piece Peace is really powerful um, just because we need each other. I, we're in such a busy world where it's it's easy to just get a little isolated and you're so busy. You said your kids are young and you're running around and uh, so, so just to be able to kind of pick it up, put it down, the stories are short. They're uh, two or three pages each, so you can just pick it up, throw it in your purse, bring it along in the car, and maybe you'll see a little bit of yourself and, and kind of look at your own story and how that maybe can connect with other moms because we really need each other, I think. 100%. Yeah. Even talking with you in the green room and the other <laughs> guests, it's like, it's so with nice. With my baby who's up there and my yeah. mom, so. Oh, hey, shout out to Dashiell and Lori because he was up in the green room just <laughs> making us feel all there. There he is right there. There's Dashiell, yep. He's playing up against the glass right there. So cute. So like I said, moms, you know, are juggling more than sometimes we even yeah. see. Now right. you're the editor of yeah. this Her View from Home. Tell us about that and what yeah. other articles we can kind of read from Yeah, that. so it's a submission site, Her View From Home, and we, we publish stories on motherhood, marriage, faith, and grief, and relationships are kind of our main uh, core pieces. Um, anybody can write for us, so it's kind of a, if you have a, a story that you want to submit, we, we take those. We like to just kind of give anyone a voice um, to say, like I said, your story is important. So it's, it's somewhere that we can just kind of share those stories because we really think stories are very powerful and they connect us and bring us together. So that's that's kind of the work I do. I, I do submissions and, and I helped uh, put this together. It's been about three years in the making. It takes a long time to do a uh, traditional publishing and then, yeah, there's uh, it's it's been fun though because it came out about two weeks ago and yeah, it I was has say, done well. It's so. done very well. <laughs> yeah. We're taking a look at photos yes. from, I believe it was like the launch party yeah. that you all had and got to travel to Omaha. Yes. Did you get to attend? I did, oh yes. My gosh. So our our owner and the named author is Leslie Means. She's the uh, the founder and the owner of Her View From Home. So she kind of guides everyone through this book. But the, those contributors, there's about 90 of us and about 60 of us uh, gathered in Omaha two weeks ago and had this this great event, which was really fun, and, and that's even a testament just to the community that we need, I think. Mm -hmm. um, and we all kind of instantly knew each other because we knew each other's stories so well. So, yeah, it's a powerful thing. Well, it's done so well. We're talking about these bestseller yeah. lists already, only out for two <laughs> weeks. How can we purchase the book? Where can we find it? Yes, so it is available anywhere. Books are sold. Um, Amazon has stock still. We were just notified yesterday that our first print run has sold out, but there are more coming. So. Um, I know Barnes & Noble is carrying it in-store here in Bismarck and in Minot and several areas. Um, a lot ask at your local bookstore. I think Ferguson Books is also carrying it. Um, so your indie bookstores, uh, really anywhere books are sold, Target, Walmart.com, all those places. So Perfect yeah. gift in yes. time for Mother's Day. And you can still get it in time for it. So. <laughs> get it fast before it does sell yes. right. <laughs> Thank you, Carolyn, yes. for being with us yeah, today. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks for having me. And you can find So God Made a Mother on Amazon at Target, Walmart, Barnes & Noble, just like Carolyn mentioned. And to learn more, also check out Her View from Home. Dot com.